One, two, three, four! Tina, Tony, Tina, Tony, far the best of friends. Tina, Tony, Tina, Tony, fun that never ends. No matter what the weather, we sing out loud together. Tina, Tony, Tina, Tony, never want to stay at home. Tina, Tony, Tina, Tony, just like salt and pepper. Tina, Tony, Tina, Tony, have their fun one night. No matter what the weather, we sing out loud together. Tina, Tony, Tina, Tony, never want to stay at home. Tina, Tony, Tina, Tony, never want to stay at home. Tina, Tony, Tina, Tony, never want to stay at home. Brain. <sighs> Tony, I'm done. Now you can go have a turn on the jump rope. No, no, because I'm a hippo, not a rabbit. Well, looking for you, you can actually be anyone. Oh, yeah? So you could just become a, hmm, a bird? Of course I could. Just watch. I'll do it. No, you don't have wings. That's true. But I have ears. I'll just use these to fly. Up, up and away. It's not so easy. Told you you're not a bird. Hang on. Not every bird has to fly, like penguins. Check this out. I'll be the best flightless bird there ever was. All right, then. You can walk like a bird. But tell me this. What will you eat? Birds eat worms. They eat what? Fault. But also because you're an elephant and not a bird. Mm. Birds can huh? eat seeds too. Come on, Tony, let's find some. I'll be a bird that eats only seeds. <laughs> for the winter. They're finding a new home. I think I should go too. Uh... Since I'm a full-fledged bird and all. Farewell, <laughs> mm. friend. Guess I'll see you next spring. I know you need to migrate, but I'll miss you. that don't fly south in winter, like pigeons, sparrows. I like the way you think, Tony. And if I'm staying here, looks like I'll need to make me a warm nest. See, Tony? I told you I could become a bird. No, you're not. <sighs> Real birds hang around on trees. They spend almost all their time up there. Piece of cake. <gasps> Stop! That's dangerous! Do not worry, Tony. Birds never fall down from trees. Uh. <laughs> ah! Tina! Tina! Are you okay? It's just... Need to train my wings more. It's regular old bird stuff. Hey, you win, okay? You, you, you can be anything you want to be. You became a real bird. Huh? Aha! Uh -huh. I'm right. That means you can finally jump like a rabbit with me. Uh. Keep it up, mm. rabbit. Mm. Let mm. me join you. Mm. <laughs> Cooking by the book. What a nice day. 
I think we should do a picnic. We'll eat all around here and go swimming. And then all our friends can come. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. I'll bake a pie, and you can bring the swimming stuff. No, not a chance. You take forever to make a pie. I'll do it in no time. You get the swim stuff. And all these things need recipes, right? And the dough takes a lot of work. What? Uh... No way, Tony. My way of baking is fast. Last one to the picnic is a rotten hippo. <laughs> I'll make the best blueberry pie of all time with these delicious blueberries that are... All gone? I can't make a pie now. Hmm, I'll bake bread. Morning, everyone. Want to come to a picnic? Hey there, sounds picnic? fun. What's that? We all eat outside and go swimming. Best of all, Tina's making blueberry pie. Ooh, sounds fun. Well, <laughs> looks like we'll need more swimming caps in that case. Come with me. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Tony, do you think there'll be enough pie for all of us? I bet I could eat ten pies. Tony always says he uses three cups of flour. Hmm, I think I'll just pour. And here you go. Ah! Uh, 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 uh. Swimming. Here are your swim caps. Hooray! Wonder when we get to eat already. Hungry oh. shark, out of the way! <laughs> Maybe I overdid the baking soda a bit. How will it go in the oven? Hmm, not bad. No need to bake. I think it's done. We're tired of swimming! Yeah! Let's just relax. I'm sure Tina will be here soon. I wish we had caps that fit. I think ours came in hippo size. Just wait until they see my pie thing. Picnics aren't really so fun. This is more boring than picking berries. Ah, oh, what a beautiful day. <laughs> We're still waiting on Tina to come. What's that on the hill? It's a huge monster. Oh, I'll protect you from whatever that thing is. Ta-da! May I present the world's best pie thing, or a what bread pie that? thing. Go on, have a bite. It's delicious and still relatively fresh. Uh, whoa, what's up there? A bicycle? And a jump rope! I see a ball up there! You were right, Tony. I guess there's a reason bakers use recipes. I wouldn't worry about it. You brought the pig with more things to do. Also, look, there's still time to make pie. <laughs> Now that's the way to make a proper pie. Picnics <laughs> <laughs> are the best thing ever! A not so still life. <laughs> six at most. Well, fine. But you kept moving around. I know. Hm. How about we stop drawing portraits and instead do landscapes? Oh, okay. <laughs> What's that? A landscape just means we paint the outside. Why do we need to go to a tree to draw? Ugh. I remember how trees look. I'll imagine a tree, like that one.
Or like that one. Any imaginary tree. That's not the point, Tina. These drawings aren't supposed to be imaginary. Landscapes are drawing what's real. Trees are the perfect thing to draw. They're still. They won't move around while you draw. It's great, huh? So which of these trees will be our subject? Maybe a pine tree or an oak or... Huh? The apple tree. So, how does one start these? Uh, landscapes? It's simple. Just paint exactly what you see. First you paint the branches, then the leaves, and under those tasty apples. Make sure to get the bark stripey. Oh, what's that? What are you doing? What does it look like? I made a bear. What's a bear doing there? Nothing. He's having a good time. I mean, why did you draw a bear? He told me to draw what I see. And over there, I happen to see a bear. Ugh! Am I supposed to draw the ice cream penguin too now? <laughs> Actually, both of my subjects are leaving. Now there's nobody to draw. That's why you should draw just nature and trees. They never go anywhere at all. They always stay in one place. You forgot that nature also has very bouncy rabbits. Look at them hop. Ball. Oh, look! There goes the rest of the apples! <laughs> Did you at least manage to draw the apples while they were still on? Yep. Now I have to erase them. What a pain to do. I'm not finished yet. I wasn't trying to look anyway. So now that the apples are inside the bear, how do what? I draw them? You don't. I told you. Only draw what you see. I see rabbits having a really bad day. That's just heartbreaking. Focus on your painting. Hey, Bear's back. He brought the ice cream with him. I'm not even going to try drawing the ice cream. That'll disappear immediately. Huh? Now the penguin disappeared, too. This is turning out to be a very interesting subject. <laughs> Whatever Bear's doing, it looks like fun, right? Well, there they go. Now to focus. This tree just needs a few finishing touches on the branches and we'll be all... Hey, what's going on? Huh? Huh? You. All done. You're done? Show me. Well, it's not very realistic, but it's okay. Don't feel bad. Not all landscapes can be as realistic as mine what is. on earth? Where's the tree? Didn't have room for it. No big deal. Nature is tough. Next time we'll try Impressionism. Gifts, Gifts for, for Santa. Santa. Aha! Oh, hey, it's just you. Morning, Tina. Come with me. I can't right now. I'm waiting for Santa Claus. But I've been thinking, um... Whoa, that's a lot of sweets. What's the occasion? Santa always gives away presents, but he gets none. So I got these for him. I hope he likes it. That's interesting. You're right. He does give them, but we don't give anything back. Let's go give it to him. One right, one, here, one right here, one right here. Like this, this looks one. good. Okay. Pretty. Now this tree's sweet. Hmm. Seems like something's missing. Like the other half of the tree. I have more candy at my house. So many, like a million. Come on. Tony, what if we're too late and we miss him? No, we're good. Because Santa only comes after we're asleep. Well, I won't go to sleep. I'll stay up and wait, and when he comes, I'll say, Hi, Santa, you're the best, but can you come more often, please? Like in the summer, we'll throw a big party for you. Maybe in the huh? best uh -huh. So much candy! So we really did miss Santa. That's kind of strange, <gasps> though. Uh, uh, it seems he forgot. You and I entirely. Or he just hasn't come to our house yet comes at night, 
when we're asleep. Let's go. One thing I don't get, if Santa comes at night, why do you get to the rabbits in the middle of the day? The rabbits are little kids. They take naps in the afternoon. No, see? He must have been here because he took our gifts for him. Why else would they be gone? Hey, that's unusual, Tina. Since when does Santa have teeny tiny feet? Huh. And there's not one set of prints, but two. There were two miniature Santas, oh. and we missed them both? Over there! Mm -hmm. Look, that's the tree right here! That's where he left the candy! Where are they Did now? Did they run out? I want They're candy! Out. Look here! We took them huh? down first for you! Oh, oh, candy. Oh, candy. Oh, yummy! My favorite! What did you get? A chocolate bar! I got toffee! Why did you tell them we left out for Santa? I think it's for them. No, it's okay. And see, they're all so happy. Ah, that Santa sure is a great guy. Always give him candy. Well, he's left with none. None at all? Huh? That's not yeah, fair. Yeah, we should get Santa something. Something totally perfect. I want to get him something. <laughs> Santa, I hope you'll like it. I wonder if Santa will enjoy all the things we got hmm. him. I didn't even think to ask if Santa knows how to ride a bike. <gasps> oh, the sky is so beautiful. Wow. Amazing. Look at all the colors. Huh? Santa Claus. We missed him. It's okay. He'll always be back next year. Oh, there's presents! Huh? <gasps> Hooray! Presents! <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> A telescope! Where's mine? Uh, uh, oh, arrows! Uh, That's I'm so happy. <laughs> My arrows are cool. Oh, <laughs> Here. To the lovely children, the best gift for me is you being good the whole year. Merry Christmas. Please be good. Love from Santa Claus. You're the best, Santa Claus. A spot of luck. Fishing net, some rope, umbrella, and I can't forget my rain boots. Salt for cooking. Compass. That's an important but one. But what if we still get lost with the compass? We'll find each other with this loudspeaker. Hello! <laughs> we all packed? Almost, Tina. Throw that in, too. We're ready to fish! <laughs> hmm, Jupiter is in retrospect. Not good. Hmm? Hey, what's up, you guys? Going fishing. Can I come? Fish is my favorite food. Here you go. Awesome! My own rod! This is gonna be great! <laughs> What's the suitcase for? Uh, oh my! Ouch. I forgot the bucket! Guess we gotta go back home then. Going home after you leave is bad luck! Bad what now? Bad luck! It's like spilling salt or falling backwards off a ladder! All of those things can mean the bad luck curse! Let's go! Time to fish! <laughs> bad happens in these woods, so I think we're good. Yeah, you're right. Ah, it's broken! Look, the handle! Yep, I told you it's bad luck! It's okay. Luckily for us, I'm the world's best suitcase fixer. Whoa! Ta-da! Behold my newest invention. The draggable suitcase. That's such a wonderful invention, isn't it, Foxy? Oh, no, no, no. 
Wait, wait, hang on! Tony, which foot did you trip on? Hmm, the left one? Tripping on your left foot indicates danger. That means it's true! <gasps> it's bad luck! <laughs> we should not go fish. Ah, uh, so should we go home? No, we can't go back. I'm confused then. We shouldn't fish and we can't go back? Oh, uh, what if we walk backwards? Look, we're going back, but also not. <laughs> oh, dear! <laughs> we broke the mirror on top of everything else. There's no way we'll recover our luck. <laughs> we're doomed now! <gasps> knocking at the door now. I don't know. We have to see what's chasing us. Or we could not. An elephant always investigates. Hmm? <laughs> it's okay. It's just this. Our unlucky suitcase. You know I meant to do all that. I thought maybe I'd pop by for tea. Oh, your tablecloth is upside down. That kind of thing is bad luck. <laughs> Stop it. There's no such thing as bad luck. That's right, Tony. None. <laughs> <laughs> I love bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, maybe I'll believe in good luck. Spring cleaning. You want to play, Tina? Uh. Hey, you want to play, Tina? I can't right now, Tony. I'm doing spring cleaning today. See? Whoa. Oh, hey. Hey, my ball. How am I supposed to find my ball in that pile of stuff? That's why we do spring cleaning, and then we'll find your ball. That looks a lot like a pile of garbage. Nonsense. Everything here is extremely useful. This just looks like a broken brush. Toss it. I'll fix it. This just became a pencil. It's a hairbrush, or instead you use it as a drawing pencil. Hey, I recognize these, but from a long time ago. Those belong to our snowman. Huh? If only you didn't melt. Uh huh. Once it snows, we'll use it again. Hey, look, this one's gotta be trash, isn't it? How can you say such a thing? It's the control deck for my extra awesome spaceship. All set. Engines on. And lift off. We're entering the Elephant Nebula. Hey, how'd you throw that away? That's mine. It's a broken soup pot. Soup would just spill right out. But you can plant a flower in it. See, look. Uh, uh, uh. How about this broken chair? You can't sit on it. Nope. This one's trash. Huh? Leave my favorite riding horse alone. That one stays. Ha ha! Woo! Let's go! Oh yeah! <laughs> I think our horses are tired out. You can take a nap. There, and we're almost done with our cleaning. Well, what else is there left to clean? This old blanket. Let me see that. Tony, this isn't just any old blanket. 
This is the top of my little cottage. This house will protect us if it rains or snows outside. Hmm. Hold on. Won't we have to do spring cleaning huh? for two houses now? How about this old sweater? Look, it's got a great big hole. I've had that sweater for a long time. I wore it back when I was small, and I'm talking baby small. See these milk stains? Whoa. Ugh. Ah, babyhood. Those were simpler times. But Tina, you're more grown up now. So what? Doesn't mean I still can't wear it. Huh? My ball! Woohoo-hoo! Yeah! Okay, what do we still have left to clean? Let's do it! <laughs> Just the super outdated paper. <sighs> well, I guess we can throw that away then. Put that in the garbage, Tony. <laughs> Fresh from the ground. Danny and Felicia are going to see the rainbow flowers. What? Danny, Felicia, stop! Oh. Why won't you listen to me? Those caves are dangerous. Stay away. Time to go home now. That's right. Hurry up now. Hear that? Interesting. Yeah, we got free carrots. Rainbow flowers, he said. Have you seen them? No, wait. Didn't he say it was dangerous? And now he's made me curious. We'll go real quick and then we'll go home. This must be the place. What lovely flowers. Well, sounds good. <laughs> Let's go home. Ho, 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 ho. Who said that? Hey! Did you hear that? Hello? Did one of the rabbits run in? <laughs> hey, rabbit. You should go home. What if that poor rabbit is lost? We should go help but them. But shouldn't we first go into Terrace? That seems safer. I think you're being a scaredy hippo. Going into a cave is dangerous. We should go get help. See? They do need our help. Let's go! It's empty. But I know I heard a voice. Hey! Now it's on the other side. Which way should we go from here? You go that way. I'll go that way. This way we'll find them for sure. <sighs> Tony, where are you? Who's that? carrots because I was scared. That's stuff. okay, because that's how I found you. <laughs> hey, look! Huh? A vine! It leads out of the cave! <laughs> Careful! <sighs> nope. We're really stuck. You know, I might have an idea. Hmm? Huh? <gasps> Tina! No! Oh, Tony, what's wrong? This last carrot is our ticket out of here. Huh? Hey, what are you doing with the flower? Here we go. Last carrot of the season. Uh, What's huh? that? <gasps> Look at this nice flower. I it want to keep it. out of the sky. So cool. Oh, where's where's that it? from? <sighs> Hooray! Ready? And pull! And pull! And pull! And pull! And pull! And pull! <laughs> 
Someone's there? Oh, no! <laughs> Manny, Danny, Lenny, Penny, Benny, Sammy, Joe, and Felicia. And that's it, all here. Then who's that stuck in the cave? Who are you? Huh? Me? That's just an echo. You can hear it in big spaces repeating what you say. Cool! Pizza! I'd like to eat straw! Who wants some carrot cake? Yeah! Treasure hunters! No, I lost another game. Oh man, not just that. You lost another piece. Not to worry, I'll find it. Oh, hi, little sneaky piece. It's not like I want to lose each time, but at least I don't get lost under stuff. <laughs> I've never seen that tiny door before. Huh? Neither have I. That's weird. Achoo! Whoa. What on earth is this? It's a map. A key, too. Do you think that Granny left us a treasure? I think we should just put it back. Anyway, it's probably all dusty. No oh. way, Tony. Can't pass up a treasure. Wonder what kind of treasure it is. Maybe a magic wand? <sighs> I'm pretty sure wands aren't real. Look, I see a rope bridge. Will that rope bridge even hold us? Only one way to find out. Wait, we shouldn't cross that. You know what we should do instead? Go and play checkers. Don't be scared. Oh, hey, Tony, this thing is rocking. Oh, this was a bad idea. Hang on, okay? Why would I not hang on? Oh, oh, thanks, Tony. Oh, this isn't so bad. We're okay, let's go. I'm getting kind of hungry now. Yeah, me too. Ooh, what if the treasure is a magic picnic blanket? We'll just say abracadabra, and the tea and cookies will magically appear. Why would we need that? A backpack works fine. And abracadabra, here's your tea. Ah. Here, donuts too. Tony, it's you who has the magic. X marks the spot. And this is the spot. All right. Oh man, we forgot to bring a shovel. What will we do now? Wow, Tony, you plan for everything. I'll go and dig it up. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Here. It's a flying carpet. We'll hop right on and be home in a split second. What are those things? Looks like money. Except it's weird. I don't think it'll buy us ice cream. I guess this treasure's useless, huh? Not quite. I bet we can use these. Give you one guess how. Still would have liked the magic carpet. 
I can't believe it. You won. That's the first game I've ever won. Seems these things really are magical checker pieces. I guess they are. Thanks a lot, Granny. Lost and found. Especially the chocolate flavor, too. Huh? Ow! Looks like somebody dropped their bag. Oh, right! There's enough in here to buy at least three cones. Let's go! <sighs> Tina, whoever lost this purse is probably looking for it. We should bring it to a lost and found. No, it's not lost. I found it. Just think. Wouldn't you be sad if you lost the bag somewhere? Ah. Too bad for them. Huh? <laughs> my bag! I lost all my money! You see now? <laughs> all my money! I think I had at least three cents! <laughs> Stop crying, friend. I found your bag. Is it true? <laughs> Hooray! My bag! Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> A lot of people are misplacing things. I'm not returning this one no matter what you say. It's mine! Tina, no! <laughs> huh? No, no, no! My bag! It's got to be somewhere. <laughs> Where could it be? Oh, 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 Aggie, huh? where'd you go? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> Here, stop dropping things on the ground, okay? Come on, third time's a charm. <laughs> oh, hi. Um, have you seen a bag anywhere around here that's been dropped? <laughs> Oh, that's too bad, then. <sighs> oh, oh! <laughs> it's my bag! How awesome! You found it! <laughs> Weird that everyone seemed to lose their stuff today. But I feel like I lost the most. Well, we'll have candy someday. <coughs> huh? Tina! Tina thank, thank you for all, all your help, help today. today! Tony, it looks like I actually did get my wish to eat candy! Hooray! You like vanilla, right? Yes! Well, these are great! And this one's mine. <laughs> ah, delicious! <laughs> <laughs> the wolf! Tony! Tina! You haven't seen a wolf, have you? There are no wolves in Cookie Village. See now? There are no wolves. Huh? Who are you talking to? Felicia. Hello. What are you doing in there? I'm frightened. She's frightened of everything. 
Storms are scary, the dark is scary, and now this wolf is scary, too. <laughs> a wolf! Go on, Rabbit. You do what needs doing, and we'll deal with the wolf. So where's this wolf, then? Oh! Wolf, where oh! are you? Wolf? He's in the tree! <laughs> hmm, yes. A tricky case. This calls for extraordinary measures. When Tony is in, Tina too. Tina, give me your hand. It's a wolf trap. If the wolf turns up, he's definitely going to want to eat the sheep. But the sheep are wooden. The wolf will break his teeth on them and run away. Great! See, Felicia? Now I've got nothing to fear from the wolf. Let's go home. Hey! Oh no! The sheep! Five and six and seven and eight. The sheep! If you want to grow up big and strong, eat carrot pudding and you won't go wrong. One, here. two, uh -huh. three, I'm here. four, yes. five, That's six, Over here. seven. Felicia! Tony! 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 Felicia! Felicia's gone! Felicia! 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 She's nowhere to be found! But what if there's a wolf in Cookie Village? There's no wolf, Rabbit, remember? Let's go! There she is! Over there! Felicia! We're coming! Don't be afraid! Oh, I'm not afraid. What are you doing here? Go on, have your supper and off to bed. I can't. I'm watching over the sheep. If that wolf comes for them, he'll get it from me. Whoa. I don't think she'll leave without the sheep. I should have made the sheep from straw. Ugh. They wouldn't be so heavy then. <sighs> she fell asleep by herself. And in a storm like this. Thank you, Tony. Thank you, Tina. You've taught Felicia to be brave. You've got the sheep to thank for that, not us. Felicia was so afraid for them that she became brave. Good night, you two. Rabbit, could we stay the night with you? It's just such a terrible storm. <laughs> 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 So which should we take? Both. Exactly, Tina. That's the only way we'll know which path is better. See you at the river. Oh, what a wonderful meadow. Oh. Berries. Yummy. Such a shame that's 
Tony isn't here. Hmm, he likes berries too. <laughs> Here we are. We're first, which means our path is better. I wonder, how far is Tina? Friends, we need to go. Goodbye, old tree. Clouds await me. Tina, you are a poet. That one's a ship sailing by. That's a carrot. And that's a carrot. And another one. I'm hungry. That cloud looks a bit like Tina. Tony, look what I can do. <clears throat> She's been gone a long time. <laughs> I see mushrooms. Oh! <laughs> We're not picking these. We'll fly around them. Something else. Oh. <laughs> Don't be so scared. Look at me. I'm not afraid of a thing. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Oh. Oh. Still there? Yup, still wiggly. Oh. So, if we can't pull the tooth out, that means then we'll just have to stick it down. Uh, what? I bet we can stick it back down with something sticky, like... Ooh, like jelly! Yum, jelly. Dig it! Hum. I like this plan. I better help the moral support. Hum. Hum, hum. 
We're all out. Oh man, I really could have used some more. Oh. I'm sure there's more. This one's sure to help you. Hmm, nope. We're officially out of jelly. Hmm? Clever mouse dentistry? That's where you should go. I'm scared, too. There's no reason to be afraid of doctors. Not at all. Dentists, no way. Nothing scary at all. I'm always this brave. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. Baby teeth fall out now and then. They're making space for big grown-up teeth. I'm not afraid of the dentist. All my teeth, my baby teeth fell out. No problem at all. Open wide, please. Mm. Don't be afraid. I'm only taking a peek. Oh. I see. Some hippo needs to floss. We'll start with a cleaning. One moment. Mm, yes. That one simply won't do. That's not what we need. Oh! The perfect size toothbrush. Oh. Come on, let's open wide. Oh. <laughs> ah -choo! My tooth came out with no pain. Wonderful job. Thanks a lot, Dr. Mouse. Don't you want to check up while you're here? Please sit. Uh, you know, uh, I, uh, have a thing I have to do. Ah! You're afraid, too? Why didn't you say? Uh, the truth is, I'm really afraid of this stuff. At least you're brave enough to admit it now. I'll never boast like that again. That I promise. I'll be the most honest, more than anyone. The most honest in the world. Okay, we get it. Oops. <laughs> 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 Off this planet, said Bubba. Do you even have a spaceship? said the captain. I can build one, said Bubba. We'll come find you when you're done building one. And meanwhile, keep hiding our secrets. Secret, secret. Tony, let's go for a walk. Oh, not now, I'm sleeping. Sleep? It's daytime. Uh, sorry, maybe later. It's very important. <laughs> huh? Aha! Uh -huh. mm. Hi, Penguin. Afraid it's only me today. Farewell, huh? Broken TV. It only played the Snowstorm Channel. And that was boring! Huh? The whole thing's gone! Take it off my hands. 
is really cool. I'll just finish my spaceship and join the ranks of the huh? captain. You're leaving for space just like that? And me? Uh, you... You can come as well, since we're friends. But don't tell anyone at all, because it's the secret of the captains. I'm the best at keeping secrets. Oh, hi, Piglets. Uh, Wanna come uh, to space with us? I you wanna go! <laughs> but it is a secret, right, Tony? Not now. It's not a secret now. Yes, it is. Just a little less. It's all ruined. Now the huh? space captains won't come. Wait, come back! Just go play without me. Bubba waved despondently as the captains flew away. Since he had built his own ship, Bubba was now one of their ranks. And like that, he was ready for takeoff. Looks like my spaceship is ready to go too. I'm a space captain. Huh? If they're not coming now, can can we go for a walk instead? We think it'd be fun. You're all right on time. Would you like to be a part of my spaceship crew? We're going to space. Yeah! Oh, I feel bad for not keeping your secret. I was just so excited. Secrets are hard to keep. Yeah, I know they are, especially ones as cool as this one. Plus, we're our own band of space captains. Yeah. We have our own secrets. Prepare for liftoff. Three, two, 